It's February 17th, 2021, and we've just released an update to Descript with some big new features. We've been talking about it internally, and actually we think this might be the best version of Descript ever, but I don't know, see what you think. There are nine new things. First, just as you are finally getting comfortable using the tab key for playback, we've gone and made it so you can use the space bar, like every other app that plays audio and video. It might seem like, why was this so hard? Why didn't you always do it that way? And the answer is because Descript is a text editor and the spacebar does other things. But we figured that all out and now you can use spacebar for playback. This ties into our second big new feature. We've made a complete overhaul to the way that transcript correction works. It's now simpler. There's no longer a separate correction mode. But more importantly, we've made it faster than ever to correct a transcript. We have a whole separate video on this, but in short, you highlight the word you want to correct, you click the correct button, and you correct it. But the fast thing is when you use the keyboard shortcuts. Hold E and click a word to correct it. And if you do this during playback, it'll pause until you're done and then resume from the correction. Hold W and click to cycle through common punctuation options, and hold Q and click to toggle capitalization. So with these three shortcuts, you can correct the whole thing without really pausing. Number three, Descript now automatically adds room tone to gaps in your recordings. We have another video on this that's definitely worth watching, but very quickly, here's what gaps normally sound like. And let's see, what else? Um, let's see, I started... And here's what they now sound like in Descript. What else? Um, let's see, I started... Um, let's see, I started... Do this all just works automatically. You don't need to do anything. Number four. Now, when you remove filler words, we do some stuff to optimize the edit boundaries and make them sound more natural. This is another one that you might not even notice. You'll just notice that you find yourself tweaking edits less often. Number five, a highly requested feature. You can now record your webcam full screen and full resolution. Mac only for now, but Windows is coming soon. Number six, we've streamlined composition publishing. We've got this new handy button here. And then after you've published, we've got a link right here that'll take you back to your published page. Number seven, our embeddable video player now has playback speed controls. We've also just made the controls on this page nicer and easier to use. Number eight, we've made some improvements to how we deal with file storage on your computer. Now, if you're exporting or performing some other rendering operation and you don't have the high quality original files downloaded, we'll download them automatically. So you never get into a situation where you've mistakenly exported using lower quality files. And finally, number nine, you can export videos as animated GIFs. Wow, that's a lot of new stuff. We've also got the normal assortment of bug fixes and performance improvements. Hope you like it all.